Okay, let me write the time quickly. We're going to do some listening. Are you ready? Yes. Yes, okay. Can you see the paper? Can you see the picture? Yeah, I can. Okay, is it very small? Can you read it? Okay, let me try and make it bigger. Uh, we'll have to put it like that. Okay. Um, Siri, are you there? Okay, uh, Tao, do you know how to draw on your screen? Um. Do you know how to draw on the computer? Mm. Yes. Yes, you know how? Okay, Siri, do you know how to draw on the computer? I want to show you quickly, okay. Okay, now we're going to listen and you're going to draw the for the picture. You're going to draw on the picture, okay? Let me just get back to our listening. Okay. Where's Peter? Can you see him? He's wearing a blue t-shirt. Is he cooking? That's right. He's cooking sausages and eggs for breakfast. Mmm, I'm hungry. Okay, that's the Can example. Can you see the line? This is an example. Now you listen and draw lines. How are you going to do number one? One. Which girl's Daisy? She's got a bowl of water. What's she doing? She's washing her face. Oh, yes. Oh, that water's cold. Which girl's Daisy? Can you draw a line for me to Daisy? She's washing her face. Tao, do you know? Yay, very good. Okay, Siri, number two is for you. Two. What about Fred? What's he doing? He's sleeping. Where? I can't see him. He's under that blanket. Oh, yes, he's very tired. Yay, good job, Siri. Okay, let's do number three, Tao. Three. Where's John? He's sitting on the grass. What's he doing? He's looking at the map. Yay, good job. Four. Siri. Look at Sally. Where is she? She's standing up. What's she got in her hand? It's her toothbrush. Yay, good job. Wow, you guys are good. Tao? Five. Can you see Jill? Yes. She's behind the chair. What's she doing? She's putting her towel on it. It's very wet. Good job, yay. Okay, I think that's the end. Of now listen to part one again. Okay, now we can carry on. Very good, you guys. Well Which done. Stacey? Okay, let's go. She's move got on. a bowl of water. What's she doing? 
She's no. washing her face. There's an advert. Okay, let's clear. Now we're going to do part two. Okay, in part two, you're going to tell teacher. Okay, so you're going to tell teacher what to write. First, we're going to listen to everything. Okay, then we're going to listen again. And I will stop and you tell teacher what to write, okay? Okay, first everything, you're going to listen carefully. Here's one example. Hello, I work here in the library. Can I ask you some questions, please? Yes, okay. Thank you. Now, what's your name? Sue Clark. Is that C-L-A-R-K? Yes. Can you see the answer? Now you listen and write. One. Now, how old are you, Sue? I'm 12. Sorry, how old? 12. Okay, fine. Two. And where do you live? I live opposite the park. What's the name of the street? Hill Street. Is that H I double L? Yes, that's right. Okay, Tao, you can do number two. If you don't know how to type, you can just tell teacher. Uh listen again okay let's listen siri we're going to we're going to listen to everything and then we listen again and then we're going to write okay so you don't need to write anything now siri okay okay three now which day do you come to the library mm, i can only come once a week on monday not at the weekend no I come on Monday after school. Okay, just wait. Four. And how many library books do you read every week, Sue? I read seven books a week. Seven? <laughs> That's a lot. Well, I love reading. Siri, no more writing. Five. We're going to and do it last, after. What kind of books do you like best? Oh, I don't know. That's difficult because I like a lot of different kinds of books. Well, do you like books about animals or people? Hmm. The books I like best are about horses. Oh, we've got a lot of books about horses here. Thank you, Sue. Okay, now we're going to write. We're going to listen again. Okay, Siri, you can do number one, but let's listen first and then you now can listen write. To it. Part two again. Okay. One. Now, how old are you, Sue? I'm 12. Sorry, how old? 12. Okay, fine. Okay, Siri, you can write now. It's 12. 12, yes. Like you did just now was good. You can put it there. Okay. Tao, you're going to listen for number two, okay? Okay. Two. And where do you live? I live opposite the park. What's the name of the street? Hill Street. Is that H-I-double-L? Yes, that's right.
If you can't type it, you can tell teacher and I will do it for you. Oh, okay. He says double L, not W. Okay, hill, double L. So that means two L's. Okay. So H I double L. So H I L L. Yes. Okay. Suri. Three. Now, which day do you come to the library? Mm, I can only come once a week on Monday. Not at the weekend? No, I come on Monday after school. Okay, we don't need a one, just Monday. We don't need number one, only Monday. But that is correct. And when you write Monday, the first letter must be capital. Okay, because it's a day of the week. Okay, that's fine. Perfect. Tao, let's do number four. Four. And how many library books do you read every week, Sue? I read seven books a week. Seven? <laughs> that's a lot. Well, I love reading. Okay, Suri, last one, number five. Five. And last. What kind of books do you like best? Oh, I don't know. That's difficult because I like a lot of different kinds of books. Well, do you like books about animals or people? Hmm. The books I like best are about horses. Oh, we've got a lot of books about horses here. Thank you, Sue. Books about Do you need help, Siri? Must I help you? Yes. Yes, you, okay. Books about horses. Like this. Horses. Okay, good. Well done. Let's move on. Now we're going to do part three. Okay, you need to listen very carefully. Okay, we can see all the pictures and all the days of the week. That is the end of part two. Oh, sorry. Okay. Ito. Yes. What is this? What is three? Sorry, that's just adverts that are playing. 
But I need to, I have to wait for them before we can listen. Okay. Okay, now we're ready. Tao, you're going to do the first one. Okay, first we're going to listen to the example. And then you're going to do the first one after the example. Look at the pictures. What did John do last week? Listen and look. There is one example. Hello, John. Where were you last week? I went to see my cousins, Peter and Sally. Did you enjoy that? Yes. On Wednesday, we went to the forest on our bikes. Did you have a picnic there? Yes. Okay, now we're going to listen. How are you ready to draw a line? Can you see the line from the word Wednesday? On Wednesday, John went to the forest on his bike. Now you listen and draw lines. One. Where did you go on Monday? We went to the lake. What did you do there? We flew our kites. Mine went into the water. Oh dear. Good. Okay, Siri. Two. And what about Tuesday? Tuesday. We rode to the village that day. Did you go on your bikes again? Yes. We went to the shop to buy some bread for our picnic. Good job, Siri. Three. On Saturday, we went to the lake again. That was nice. And we sailed our toy boats. Was it sunny that day? Yes. Lots of people swam in the lake there. Very good. Siri? Four. And on Sunday? Let me think. Oh, yes. We went for a walk. In the park? No, we went to the forest. Great. And a beautiful bird flew over our heads. On Sunday. Yay, good job. Five. What about Thursday? Sorry, I mean Friday. Did you go to the forest again? No, my uncle's got a boat and we went sailing in it. Did you have a picnic that day too? No, we took some sandwiches and had them on the boat. That's nice. Tom, yay, well done you guys. Now listen to part Okay, three again. very good. Let me just fast forward. One. Okay. Now we can go down. Part four. Look at the pictures. Listen and look. There is one example. What did Sam do at school today? Hello, Sam. Did you enjoy school today? No, not very much. Why not? We all wrote stories. Was it difficult? Yes, I like reading stories, but I don't like writing them. Can you see the tick? Now you listen and tick the box. Okay, Siri, number one for you. One. What's the matter with Jill? What would you like to eat, Jill? I'm not very hungry, Mum. I don't want any breakfast. What's the matter? Have you got stomach ache? No, but I've got earache and I'm hot. Well, you mustn't go outside today. Two. 
I've got earache, ear. Yes, good. Okay. And let's clear both of them. Good job. Okay, number two, Tao. Which child is Ben? Look at this photo of my birthday party. Can you find me? Oh, Ben, that's difficult. You're all wearing party clothes. Uh, are you the bat? No, that's my friend John. Are you the clown then? Yes, I am. And this rabbit is my sister. Yay, very good. Okay, good job. Um, let's go down. Okay, Siri. Three. What does John want for lunch? Would you like some soup for lunch, John? We had that yesterday. Can we have something different, please? What about a pizza? Oh, great. And can we have burgers and french fries for supper? We had that yesterday. What about a pizza? Yes, good. Do you like pizza, Siri? Yes. Yes. And you, Tao, do you like pizza? Yes. Yes, me too. I like it. Okay, Tao, this is for you. Four. What does Jane want to take to Jim's house? Do you want to come to my house after school, Jane? Yes, but I must do my homework first. I can bring my new video. It's great. Oh, good. We can watch that and then listen to my new CDs. Okay, Jim. What is she going to take with her? What does Jane want to take to Jim's house? Take with, I can bring my new video. And then he says, we can listen to my CDs. Okay, video. Okay, thank you for two ticks there. Okay, Siri, number five. Five. What did Nick do at the weekend? Did you go to the beach at the weekend, Nick? No, we didn't, because it was cold and windy. So, what did you do? Did you go to the cinema? No, my friend Kim phoned and we went skating. Yay, good job. Okay, now we're going to color and draw. Are you ready to do this? Okay. okay. Uh, Tao, let me just fast forward quickly. Which one? There are two. Mm. You want to come to my house after school, Jane? Sorry. That is the end of part four. Okay, Tao, you're going to do number one. But first they're going to do the example. Part five. Look at the picture. Listen and look. There is one example. Can you see the pirate with the hat? Which one? There are two. He's the oldest one. Right. Well, color his shoes purple. His shoes? Yes. Can you see the pirate's purple shoes? This is an example. Now you listen and color and draw. One. What shall I do now? You can color again. Can I color the parrot in the tree? 
Sorry, which parrot? The one in the tree. Okay, colour it. Boom! Tasty! Oh, Sweet! No. Delicious! Check it out. It's free to Colour down. it green. Colour the par... Yay! Siri, okay, it's not your turn now. Siri, now it's your turn. Okay, you mustn't have your turn. Two. Would you like to color again? Yes, please. Find the fattest pirate. I can see him. What shall I color? Color his trousers blue. His trousers. Okay. Pirate. The fattest pirate means the man. Which one is the fattest? Okay, this is a pirate parrot. So which one is the biggest, the fattest, the widest? Color his trousers blue. Look here, he's got a big belly. Fat, fat. Okay, trousers. Color his trousers blue. Good, very good. Okay, Tom. One. Three. Now what shall I do? Look at the treasure. Oh yes, the pirates are very happy. There's a lot of treasure. Yes, well, colour it yellow. All of it? That's right. Tao, it's your turn now. No, Siri, it's not the right thing. Siri, it's not your turn. Treasure. Treasure. Can you do it, Tao? Yay, okay, Siri, now it's your turn. Are you ready? Four. Can I color again? Yes. Can you find the tallest pirate? Yes, he's wearing a scarf on his head. Right, you can color his scarf red. What does the man have on his head? The tallest pirate, tallest man. Do you need help, Siri? Yes. Yes, okay. The tallest, so who is the tallest? Who is the longest man? Tall. 
Okay, we went to a color. He has a scarf on his head. We need to color it red. On his head. It's hat. Yes, okay, but he's wearing a scarf on his head. We need to make it red. Yes, good job, Siri. Okay. Okay, Tao, it's your turn now. Only Tao draws when it's her turn. This takes a long time. Five. What shall I do now? Well, you can draw something. Good. What shall I draw? Do you like stars? Yes. Well, draw two stars between the moon and the tree. Between the moon and the tree. Great. That's all. What a beautiful picture. Two stars between the moon and the tree. Tao? Good. One. One star. Two stars. Okay, good job. Very nice, beautiful picture. Okay, now we are going to go to our next listening. Um, let me take this away. Okay, let's go do our next test. Where is it? Okay. Okay, let me find it here quickly. This is the Cambridge Movers practice listening test, test two. going first after example hello where's sue she's in the water with the dolphins is she swimming that's right she's swimming with the fastest dolphin she's very good okay this... can you see the line this is an example now you listen and draw lines one which girl's Jill? She's wearing a blue dress. Oh, yes. What's she doing? She's pointing at the dolphins and laughing. Siri? Siri's turn. Did you listen, Siri? Yay, okay, now, Tao, it's your turn. Only Tao's going to draw. Two. Where's Paul? There, the boy with the camera. Right, I can see him. He's taking some pictures. Yes, he loves dolphins. Good job. Okay, Suri. Three. I can't see Nick. What's he doing? He's throwing a fish to the dolphins. Where? There. Look, he's standing up. Oh, yes. Do you need help, Siri? Rachel, my eye go, my eye again. Yes, you can hear it again. 
Let me go back a little bit. Okay, hold on. Oh, hold on. Okay, let's listen. He's throwing a fish to the dolphins. Where? Sorry. There, look. Yes, he loves dolphins. Okay, let's listen again. Three. I can't see Nick. What's he doing? He's throwing a fish to the dolphins. Where? There, look. He's standing up. Oh, yes. He's standing up. Nick. Good job, Siri. Okay. Tao. Four. Look at Anne. What's she doing? She's shouting to her friend. What's she shouting? She's shouting, quick, look at the dolphins. Teacher, I listen again. Okay. Um, our meeting is going to end. You can do it when you come back.